Hello and welcome to Yagwai Gaming where we're playing Ark and I found the cave nearby that everyone's been telling me about for a while. Uh, I did bring my saber cats here but they seem to have got lost in the forest and honestly I can't be bothered to trying to get them back. So I'm kind of kitted out for this cave run. I think I'm kitted out anyway. I've got my food, my bullets, my arrows, a spare melee weapon, a bunch of torches. Everything's repaired. I even got a jar of water, and we're on a perfect barry, the best barry that I can breed with a bunch of levels put into it as well. So we've got 12k health and almost 1k melee damage. So I think this is it. The first time I've ever stepped into a cave. I am genuinely scared. That's cool, the crystal. Can I mine that for crystal? I, I don't want to yet. I, I'm scared of getting off Barry. She's called Scale. She's awesome. I'm scared of getting off her. Uh, okay, there's nothing coming to eat me yet. Let's go further down. How big is it? Like, I genuinely don't know if this is going to be a 20 minute episode or a 3 hour episode. I don't know. We're going to be sat here until this cave is completed, that's all I can tell you. I am going to take it a little bit cautious, just... It's tight, it's narrow, and I don't know what's waiting for me around the corners. So far... Nothing? What the fuck is that? Why is it... Ooh! Lights. So there's... Oh, hello, Scorpion! Okay, the light's creeping me out, to be honest. This is very sci-fi-y. Oh, hello. Oh, that's new. Like, millipede of death. Centipede of death. And snakes. Shit, is everything in here just poisonous, then? Level 130, holy fuck. And there's more snakes. Okay, and we're quite heavy now. I think I need to turn off my dino picking stuff up, to be honest. Um, I know that's a feature. I know that's a feature. All right, let's let's take a second to do that, maybe. Really, really quick. Uh, behavior. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Enable uh, mating. Conscious. Oh no! Oh, fuck you. Oh, I should not have tried to do that, should I? That was really stupid. Should we get back? Should we move backwards a little bit and then try and do it? It, it seemed safe up here, didn't it? We might pass out from all that damage we just took. Right. Okay. Reload the gun, which was already reloaded. Um, harvest settings. There we go. Disable victim item collection. <laughs> there we go. Fallen unconscious. Oh, I made the right decision running away then. Okay. Oh shit, I had stimberries! I'm a fucking idiot. I brought them for that reason. I brought them in case this happened. And it happened, and I didn't use them. <laughs> what is what is it? If you, uh, if you fail to prepare, then you prepare to fail. Well, if I prepare, then I still fail. So that's marvellous. Oh, look at Scale's teeth. She's very pretty. Right, I think we're... Uh, we can get up when the stars run out, yeah? They don't, I don't have to wait for them to go back up again. Yeah, there we go, good. Okay. So it was harvest settings, disable... There we go, so... She should now not be collecting anything. I have that ingredient. I have that recipe, I'm fairly certain. I have that recipe, right. So now we can kill. And we can shoot stuff while on Barry, while on scale, which is cool. We've got a crossbow as well. OK, 
Okay. Right, we need to be careful. What's this then? Oh, look, it's like a ruin. Oh, I see a dinosaur with a tail. What have I hit? I've hit something and it's not happy about it. What is that? A Megalosaurus. I've never even seen that thing before. Oh, Beetle. Ah, Scorpion. Okay. Oh, oh, spiders. Oh, I don't like spiders. So, do they slow us down? Yeah, they've like webbed us, haven't they? That's cool. It's very different. Uh, ah, it's just a explorer note. Oh, it's that bastard, the one who knocks me off the, uh, the one who knocks me off in the swamp. I don't like that. Uh, but, I suppose finding that means that we can level up a bit better in here. If that's correct. Yep, we're not picking stuff up. Brilliant. And finally hit 1000 in our damage scale is scales becoming pretty powerful actually i i am now fully sold on barry's being amazing what is that uh, okay the stuff down there let's see if we can draw it to us yeah that worked Oh, and then they drop their items in that handy little bag. That's good. That's good. All right, I like this feature. Now, are we brave enough to get off and see what the fuck this is? Blueprint for a slingshot. Wow. That was worth the horror of getting off the fucking dino in this place. Okay. I must admit, I was starting to get to the point where I was thinking, like, yeah, I, I know what I'm doing in this game now. I've got, I've got a good handle on it. I know what this game has to throw at me now. But this is something else. This is fucking cool. Why are we flashing? Oh, we've been torpid. A little bit. Can we feed stimberries to the dino? Does that work? Uh, I think we tried tried that after the torpor effect had already gone, so... Hello. They're high level in here, aren't they? Oh, another... Uh, another thing, what's this? Ah, oh, Megalodon's a... a just a thing about how megalodons are, are good to train. I have not trained any megalodons, as you, as you know, because you know you're watching me play. I don't know why I felt the need to inform you of it like that. But I am currently building something that I'm not going to show you until it's done. I'm building a new home. It's it's in the same place more or less. It's just next door because I don't want to do too much weird stuff like moving house. But and then this is the. Uh, Oh, leech. Ugh. Yeah, so I'm building a new home, and it has a water... I'm building it with a water pen in it. So I should be able... Ooh, what's the graphic flash is going on? I should, hopefully, be able to soon start taming some... Um, some water-based stuff. So what's down here? Oh, God! There's stuff in the water. I mean, why wouldn't there be? Jesus, that's a lot of piranhas. It's the piranha movie! The the horror movie! That wasn't really a horror movie, it was more of a comedy, but still. Oh, wow, that's a lot of them. I think that's it. Yeah, I think that's it, alright. Oh, the baryonics are just the best thing for this, aren't they? Wait, this is where we came from then. 
Okay, am I lost already? I think I am. Wonderful. That's a good start. Okay. Is there somewhere to go? Can we get out up here? Follow the light? Yeah, I can get out up here. Cool. Oh, more spiders, more spiders. Uh, I can hear stuff. So is the torch completely destroyed? No, it's just there. Okay, I just need to put it back on. I've got a bunch of levels. Nice. Oh, hello. Again, there's not actually enough torpidity built up there for me to need to test the berries, but we are going to test them at some point, I think, and see if it works. Hello. Oh, this one's strong. This one is very strong. But, yeah, that was 150, so that's absolute max level. Jesus. That's the first level 150 thing I've seen, I think. wonder if I'm going the wrong way, and that's why we're uh, coming up behind. I need to tame some of this be these beetles, don't I? Are these, these are not dead. Huh, I don't know what direction I'm supposed to be going. Am I supposed to be going up or down? The scorpion's down there. Yeah, alright, we're, we're going to leave this bit. Keep going up, maybe, for now. Hmm. Yeah, people have been telling me I need to tame the dung beetles in here. Is this where we started? It is, we've come in a circle. Right. Okay. So what if we do just throw ourselves off here into the middle of all this enemies? Oh, that's a lot of them. Oh, my armor! Oh no! What the hell happened? How did it hit my armor when it's not hitting me? Shit, my armor's just gone. Let's have some food. Now, I don't have any torpidity issues, thankfully. Although I am going to start getting cold now because my armor's broken. Fucking marvelous. Okay. Which way to go then? Maybe. Can we fit through there? That looks promising. No. Barry definitely can't. Hello, snake! More snakes. And centipedes. Holy shit. never ending um, we've been here before as well though I think yeah we, we went through the water and then came up here where the where the fuck do we go I'm so lost yeah, and then if you go up there, it's back to where we came in. We know that. And we've gone down here. This is where we went. Uh, need to be careful of the dino's health a little bit, I think. Yeah. Oh, it's low because I... Oh, no, it's not low because I leveled up. He is... He, she is actually... She has actually lost a bit of health. All right. Let's give her a point in health and... Hopefully we'll find some fish for her to kill and that should let her heal a bit. I think I'm supposed to go through here. But Barry can't fit. And I really don't want to get off Barry. Oh, hello. Nope, that didn't work. Hmm. 
Maybe there's another way. Maybe. What about through here? Have we been through here? I don't know. Oh, it's another really low bit again. So do I have to get? Will he? Will he follow me through? Oh, I'm so scared of getting off. I'm in my dinosaur. That's not good. Please follow me. Oh god. Oh no. Oh no, this is not going well. Uh, zero, zero, zero. This isn't working, this isn't working. Draw the pistol. I think I'm shooting my dino. There we go, that worked. Alright. Oh, that went well. That went very badly. Okay. 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 I... Let's see. Yes, eating the berries makes my topidity go down. That is good to know. If I get off the dinosaur, she will follow me through there. It's just that I will panic and scream when bad things happen. Let's give her another point in melee damage. Are you ready to follow? Actually, can I tell you to follow closely? Follow distance. Lowest. Yes. Oh no! Oh, that's bad. I didn't eat more berries. Oh, fuck. And I'm dehydrated. I'm gonna die. Oh, you are fucking kidding me. I'm gonna die here, aren't I? I'm gonna die of dehydration, lying unconscious on a cave floor while my dinosaur stares at me sadly. Oh no! It's going down! We might not die! <laughs> we will if something comes and eats us while we fucking lie here. No, oh, come on. Oh no, no. Oh. How's our health doing? 301. 300. It's going down. 299. It's, it's, yeah, I'm not going to count it down. But the topidity is going down at fairly decent speed, so I should have eaten more of those fucking berries. I should bring a lot more of those berries. Um... Right, topidity's almost down. I think Dino's through the hole now, which is good. Oh, okay, okay, we're about to wake up. And then we can have a drink. Right, number nine. There we go. And then we come forward a little bit. Can she not fit through? Can she not fit through? Is she supposed to be able to fit through? I don't know what this is. I'm wondering if maybe she's not supposed to be able to fit through. I don't want to touch it! Run away! Wait, nothing happened. See something moving there. Oh god, nope, there's stuff in here. Is that it? Is that genuinely it? That's the cave run. I mean, I, I say that like it was the easiest thing in the world. I did almost die. But more because I'm an idiot rather than because it was speci specifically difficult. Interesting. So what is this thing that we've got then here? Artifact of the Hunter. Only one of these may be carried at a time by an organism. And obviously all our shit's broken. Right. And it doesn't look like there's anything left to kill. I th think we've managed it. 
if I've missed something in here, please do let me know. Because I feel like I have, because there was no loot or anything. I feel like I've missed stuff, but at the same time, I've got the thing, haven't I? That's the thing I needed. That's what I used to open up the boss areas and stuff, isn't it? This artifact. I think it is. Huh. How odd. I'm gonna guess that this is not typical and that most of them are harder, maybe? I suppose now that we've got this um, this uh, XP buff on ourselves, we need to murder everything we can find as well. But I'd like to... Oh, that sounded big. I'd like to go and have a look at the uh, obelisk, one of the obelisks, and see exactly how many of these um, artifacts I'm supposed to get in order to summon the boss because is it just the one is it multiple i i genuinely don't know i've i've not actually had a proper look at any of these things since in i think it was like episode two or three when i arrived at one fell off a cliff and died and since then <laughs> i've not bothered going near them anymore through fear of falling off another cliff and dying But yeah, if we kill everything on the way there, hopefully gain ourselves a few more levels on scale, since she she did very well in that cave. She is definitely good at caving. I have no idea where the cats ended up. I did bring all of my saber-toothed cats, and they got lost in the jungle while I was trying to find the cave. <laughs> I don't know what these things are. Okay. Oh no, the swamp between me and he between it and me. Oh, for fuck's sake! I have a tremendous fear of swamps, especially considering most of my armor is gone. Hmm. Maybe we picked off something a bit big here. No. Nope. Ooh, level ninety-five. What do you think? You think? Oh, there's a ruin there. We could add to our add to the time we're being boosted. This could go really badly. This could go really badly. We could just die in here. There we go. All right. Yep. We'll look at that later when we're not in mortal peril. And let's get out. Oh, cool. That worked. Right. So we're gonna head over to this this. Uh, Obelisk, because I am really interested in exactly how how the bosses get summoned. That's kind of what we're looking at today. Doing the cave, doing our first cave, having a look at uh, how this boss gets summoned, and then maybe doing another cave if we're feeling confident, which currently I am. I know of two more cave locations basically that I found while exploring. I found one on. Kano Island, Kano Island, thank you to whomever told me the correct name of that, so I wasn't just calling it Death Island, an evil place and stuff. And I found one slap bang in the middle of the map. Let's get this and see what see what's in it. Oh look. Crystals. A prim yeah, rubbish basically is what was in it. Absolute rubbish. Right, but we're almost at this obelisk. Ooh, be careful. Need to grab some fish to heal. Yeah, so I found one that's in, um, one on Kano Island and one, oh, hello. What level are you? Ooh. Oh, I wanna. 
I want to, I do. Oh, but if she died, I'd be heartbroken. But at the same time, I more or less now have a breeding pair for Barry's. So if she died, I'd replace her in about eight minutes. So not really that heartbroken, I guess. All right, fine, we're gonna try. Let's see. I think we're faster. Oh, I don't know its health. I can't even see if it's bloody or not. This might have been a really bad idea. If it gets us to half health, we'll run. Oh, fuck, it's gone. <laughs> nice, she's amazing. Purple, purple armor and a masterwork crossbow, but that's not as good as the ascendant crossbow I've already got. Uh, yeah, that's not as good. That's not as good. And I already have chest armor on. That would. Oh, actually, I'm gonna put this on just because you know we broke our our armor <laughs> earlier. That's her second alpha, but the first one doesn't count because it was like a level ten rex, and level ten rexes don't count. Ooh, snake! Jump over it. Bye bye. Ah, cool. Here we are. Here we are. Here we are. Ah, so these things are the things people keep telling me to get because they insulate um, the babies. They allow me to have babies without needing to light a bunch of fires, which is actually really cool. I do definitely need to get some of them then. Um, right, let's have a look at this and then, then I think we'll maybe try one more cave I feel confident about the cave Ooh, that's a high level rat high level uh, raptor and we got another carnosaur oh 120 I probably should have we should be checking this out and trying to tame them if they're that high. Yeah, she's got to the point where she's not really leveling up much anymore. She's almost there, though, for another level. She's very strong. I do like the berries now. Um, so I don't know how much I need to get ready for a boss. Like, Okay, the, I wasn't actually expecting to have a fight here. I was kind of just expecting to come in and have a look around, but all right. So where do I... Uh, where do I, like, check stuff? Is it on the top, maybe? Is there a way up to the top? Yeah, there's a bridge there. Okay, so we go across this bridge here and then this center panel yeah this light thing here right so are you gonna tell me what you want for me to summon your boss ah all oh right okay 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 so this is the different levels of boss the uh The regular, uh, sorry, the gamma, the beta, and the alpha, and the alpha one wants you to have killed certain high level, well, certain dangerous dinos, and then the gamma one wants you to have done the same thing, basically, yeah. Just more of them. Artifact of the Clever, Artifact of the Hunter, Artifact of the Massive, so what do we have? Artifact of the Hunter. Right, and then we can upload our survivor, upload creatures and stuff, item slots, I... No, I'm not going to upload scale, I love scale. So, ah, oh, right, I just click and drag, okay, okay. Clever, hunter, and massive then. 
Right. Cool. So I need to kill at least... Sorry, kill. I need to clear at least three caves in order to summon one boss then, if that makes sense. Right, okay. So I'm going to go and spend the next 900 seconds randomly killing everything I can see in order to get her some more levels or just at least some XP. She probably will actually level up from it. And then I think we're going to run over to the uh, cave that I saw in the middle of the map and we're going to see if we can do another cave. This might be me biting off way more than I can chew, but we're going to see if we can do it. We might be able to do it. We might fail and die miserably, but it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Holy fuck, that's big. What is it? Titanosaur. What, what? Will it hurt me? Will it step on me by accident? Holy fuck. Can I kill it? I feel like trying to kill it would be a really stupid idea. Wow. Okay, we're just gonna leave that thing to its uh, to its own devices, I think, and we're gonna keep moving. We're off towards the. Um... Oh god, we're off towards the the other cave that I know the location of that isn't Carnosaur Island. We're trying our best not to go into the swamps as we go there. But obviously, Crocodile here will have to die. Oh, hello, and he's got a friend. He got brought back up. No, 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 no! No, there's more of them. Fuck, there's more of them. Fuck, it's the things, it's the things, it's the things that knock me off. Doesn't matter how amazing I think Scale is, if I get knocked off her, I will die. All right, I think we're clear of this one. We need to twist array right, this way a little bit. I'm gonna kill that Spinosaur just because it hit me. And that's really rude. You need to be careful where you're swinging that tail. There we go. No tail discipline, it's not good. All right, so yeah, roughly this direction, isn't it? It's, it's right in between the mountains is where I think I saw the uh, the cave while I was flapping around trying to find a place for my new house that I'm building at the moment. Um, I settled on a place about 15 meters away from my old house because I don't like change. Uh, you'll see that eventually. I'm, I'm only going to show the new building when it's ready. It's going to be... It's, it's big. It's big. It's very big. It's going to be cool. I like building mega bases and stuff in uh, Minecraft, Seven Days to Die, you know. Uh, I don't think I ever spent enough time in Conan to actually build a mega base. But if I had, I would have eventually done it. And we're running out of time on our XP buff. That's it, it's over now. Alright. Where are we? Uh, it's on the other side of the volcano, which is usually full of horrible stuff. Every time I've come to the volcano, bad things have happened. Okay, ooh, hello. One of the, uh... Holy shit! I should do my best to catch that. Mmm. I should come back and try and catch that. Level 130 of the fingernail demons. Uh, okay, there's like a jungle. I didn't realize. I think I've already always flown over this bit, so. I didn't realize there was such a thick jungle at the bottom of the volcano. Are we out of it now? Yeah, there we go. As long as we can see where, where we're going and what's going on, we'll be fine. Uh, I forgot how horrible the land is around here. We should probably go down to the river and go along there. I mean, we are aquatic. Or semi-aquatic. 
Um, we'll seem fine here. Let's keep moving. Yeah, so that a level 130, if we can catch that and find a female for it to breed with as well, we'll be able to breed up a set of them. Apparently they're really good. I'm not a big fan of the one I've got, but it is pathetically low leveled, so it's not really fair to judge. Um, it is a bit easier to control than the Rex. The Rex is unfortunately... Especially compared to like moving around now on the Baryonyx, the Rex is unfortunately very hard to handle. <laughs> I mean, it makes sense. It's it's a big chunky boy. It's gonna be hard to handle, isn't it? Let's kill Carnosaur. Yeah. Oh, we got a bunch of Raptors. Uh, the issue with Raptors is they always come at you and you can't turn around and face them easily. So I'm just gonna run away from them. I don't think they're worth the XP. Worth. I don't think the XP is worth it anyway. I don't think I get enough from them. Hello, what level are you? 15. No point taking you. Okay. Ooh, I've got hypothermia. Why have I got hypothermia? Can I hold a torch? Will that help? There we go. Yep, that helps. I've not got hypothermia anymore. Is that another one of the uh, the birds? Oh no, it's not the uh, the one beginning with Q. Here it is! I almost ran straight past it. There it is. Hi, are we friends? I hope we are. You have a really creepy eye. You should get some help. What level are you? 105! And I've got hypothermia again. Right, we're going in. Do we have any levels to put into scale? Nope. But we can force feed her some fish just to get her maybe up to like 11k in the health department. Yeah, we don't want her to run out of food either, so there we go. 11k in the health department. Right. Cave number two today. I kind of breezed through cave number one, so I'm feeling cocky and arrogant, and that's going to be my downfall. Hubris as the Greek. Tails call it. It's a bat. We've got bats and spiders, so this is Dracula's cave. Oh, and scorpions! Right, so when everyone was recommending I go and get one of the, um, I can't remember what they're called now, the things that are really good against bugs. <laughs> I guess I know why now, because these caves are just made of bugs. Let's not rush too fast again. Let's keep it nice and steady. We've got the bat coming in. That's fine. All my friends are playing Elden Ring. <laughs> okay, and scorpion. Scorpion's probably the bigger threat than the bat. I think. I definitely think the scorpions are the biggest threat. Anything that can do torpor damage. Kill this thing here quickly as come. There we go. And let's get this. Uh, we're kind of stuck a little bit. There we go. Oh shit! Uh, I didn't even get a chance to see what that was. I'll have to go back and look at the recording and pause to see what dossier that was because. We got attacked the instant we opened it. So there's two ways to go. There's down there and down here. We'll go down here. And then we'll go there. Uh, okay, there's a bat. If we walk backwards, we usually can get into the position. There we go. Oh, there's a lot of bats. Why are there so many bats? I like bats in real life. I think they're fluffy and nice. In this, they're not. In this, they're kind of an arse. Okay. Ah, there's one of the little treasure boxes. And an army of scorpions. Ooh, they just flow over the weird terrain, don't they? That's horrible. Any more of you? Right, let's see. Can we go around and then... Let's see what's in this box. Uh, a 
saddle for something I don't recognise, which means it's not currently something I care about. What I want is a baryonyx saddle. Oh, there are snakes in the walls. There are bats in the walls as well, I suppose. That's quite creepy. Oh, there's more bats in the walls. Really high level bats, actually. Yeah, definitely the most high level stuff I've seen so far has been in these caves. Scorpion. Okay. Stick. This cave seems a bit more tricky than the last one. I am getting a bit more confused here. And we're getting stuck as well, is what we're getting. Ah, shit, bat. There we go. Right, I'm wondering about the water, but I'm also scared of the water. And I can hear a snake coming from somewhere. Wait, is that the... That's the artifact there. Oh no, we're in the water. Um, I can't get to that fucking scorpion here. Just die. Okay, I'm missing the scorpion. I mean, if I'm gonna miss, I'm gonna miss the crossbow balls because they're cheaper. There we go. Right. Is that it then? Is that another cave done? Ah, there's a spider, that's cool. Alright, let's get this artifact then. Artifacts are clever. And back onto our dino. And then. Is there anywhere else to explore? I, just, I feel a bit like surely we're missing some stuff. Like surely there's more to it. Alright, let's have a look what's in the water. I'm gonna guess an absolute shit ton of piranhas. Oh, and a barrier. Uh, not a baryonyx. Um, I'm the baryonyx. Oh, that's a lot of crocodiles! Are they all dead? Yeah, everything. Oh no, this one's stunned. Now they're dead. And then there's... doesn't really seem like there's anything down here. I mean, there's no light, so that's kind of not helpful. Huh. Uh, how do I get out? Yeah, how do I get out of the water is probably something I need to know. Oh, uh, we jump really high! And then we get stuck here. So we can't jump any higher. Whee! No. Okay, that failed. We get out here. Okay. Okay, we just get out here. Okay, so another cave done by the look of it. Is that genuinely it? Lots of metal, mushrooms and crystals in here. I'm um, thinking you could probably collect them all. Not sure why I would yet. Yeah, we've got that. What about over here? Oh, there's a, another box here. Yep, no, not reading that. Oh, there we go. Lazarus chowder, we've got the recipe for that. That's the uh, the water breathing thing, I think. Like, it's basically a potion of water breathing, isn't it? So, we didn't go down here. No, oh, okay, that just leads to there. Yeah, so we've done it. These caves are really quick and easy. Should we go and do Kansar Island? 
if we can figure out how to get out. Ah, we go through here. Should we go do the Kanasar Island one? I mean... We may as well. We're quite close. Oh, we'll have to, uh... We'd have to swim across, though. We could build a raft. We could. We could do it. Alright, I'm gonna do it. We're gonna go over to the coast near Kanasaw Island. We're gonna build a raft, and we're gonna sail over to Kanasaw Island, and see if we can complete the third cave that the the last cave I actually know about today that would be really cool if we can do that so I'm at the coast near Carnivore Island not Carnosaur Island Carnivore Island Carno Island the island that I don't like that's full of evil stuff I'm here yeah back to calling it my stupid names and I realize that I probably don't need to make a raft because I'm on a barry, and they're pretty awesome. As long as I don't hit a jellyfish, I feel confident. <laughs> I'm scared, I don't like the water. I saw the last time I was here, I don't know if I included the clip or not, because it was only like a five second long clip, the biggest fucking thing in the water. It was like a level one alpha though. So, I'm not overly scared of fighting it, but Jesus, it was big. Right, we're almost at the island. I really don't like being in the water, especially not at night when I can't see what's going on. Oh, there's our amazing trap. The uh, Feel free to take my design and use it, you know, profit from my hard work and engineering. It's not very good. It was so expensive to make. Please don't make it. There will be much better ones on YouTube somewhere. Okay, right. I have to be careful because again, the last time I was up here, there was a level 140 Alpha Rex that I ran away from because it was a level 140 Alpha Rex and you should run away from that. It's just round here, isn't it? The uh, the cave entrance. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, go away, kittens. Yeah, I like how I started the episode like, oh, I brought cats to help me, and then I'm finishing the episode by murdering a bunch of cats. Should we go and grab this uh, loot drop quickly? You never know. Could contain the amazing baryonyx saddle we've been looking for. It won't. Life's never that simple. Oh, hello, bird. You're angry with me for some reason. That seems like a bad thing to do. There we go. Just kill everything. Just don't give it the opportunity to be angry. Just let it murder it all. It's fine. Okay, right. Really quickly, then. Really quickly, let's jump off. Open it, stuff, jump back on, and then we can check what it was. Uh, woolly Rhino Saddle. Alright. Cool. Are Woolly Rhinos any good? Should, should I go and get a Rhino and put a saddle on it? I don't know. Ah, here it is. Here's the cave. Okay, cave number three. Third time's the charm. This is when a logo tits up and I'll die horribly. Ooh, it's a bit low and narrow, isn't it? I'm freezing, really, even in the cave. What's the temperature? Minus five in a cave, okay. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, I don't like it at all. I have to swim through it? Oh, it's dark. Uh, I'm stuck. I don't like this. Where do I go? Uh, this is not going well. Is this where I came in? Yeah, this is where I came in. Okay. Okay, let's... 
I'm gonna freeze to death in here, aren't I? Fuck. Uh, Hypothermic insulation, 10. Hypothermic insulation, minus. No, 30. Oh, I can't. oh, it's a blueprint, not a cloth. Oh, fuck. All right. Um, what do we do? Do we just go for it? Let's just go for it, right? Let's see if we can figure this out. So, there must be a way to go down here. What about, is there anywhere in here? No. Aha, there it is. An instant bat. Cool, and let's get the torch out and does that help at all? Not really, uh, okay. Alright, we need to be careful not to fall off here then, don't we? Okay. Wow, this one's much bigger. Wait, is that like a jump? I think that's a jump. Do I have to make a fucking jump? And the bats can kind of knock me backwards a little bit as well. Ooh, okay. There we go. Whee! <laughs> Barry's amazing. Kill all the bats. I am worried about the hypothermia. I'm actually super worried about the hypothermia. Maybe this one is the one that we try and get through quickly because of that. Which obviously seems stupid because this is definitely a harder one. And then I'm like, yeah, let's rush it. Because I'm clever. Let's see. Can we make hide armor in our pocket? That's maybe a good idea. If we jump off, what's in this? Just loot, okay. What's in this? Blueprint and a pick. Yeah, okay, so we're not. We've got nothing to make any uh, hide armor with. Maybe once we kill something, we can, as long as Barry doesn't destroy its body. There we go. Oh, wait, this is where we came down. Right, so there's like a way that you can go if you're brave or stupid, you can jump over here. Cool, alright. And then you fall down here. How are we doing for health? Not good at all, actually. Right, yeah, we need to seriously see if we can kill some of these. Um, oh no! There we go, jump. That worked. Right, let's see if we can. Can we make the armor? Uh, armor. Hide? Right. So you can make hide in your inventory. So if we can get one of those bats and butcher it and not let... Actually, um, we could turn on harvesting on our barry. Oh, that was really stupid. That was really stupid. I was trying to hold E to see if it would work, but that was really fucking stupid. Um... Is that it there? I think that might be it there. Just got a lot to clear out down here, haven't we? How are we doing? Yeah, we're not torpid yet, I don't think. Bats down there, but yeah, all right. We've got a the monkey. I'll read all this stuff later. Uh, there's the artifact. Let's. Oh no, spider! Fuck! 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 Where's my? 
Why is it not? Oh shit, are you set to passive or something? Right, let's get on and then... Okay, I don't seem to have been tranquilized too much. Let's have a drink. And let's eat some food. See if that might heal me a little bit. Okay. Yeah, this is going badly, right? Let's grab the artifact and maybe just get out. I did see some bats down there though. And I feel like if I can kill some bats, I feel like I'm fine. Wait, do they not drop bodies at all? Dehydrated. Oh, and the top is going up again. Uh, let's see. Let's do that, and then let's have a drink of water, and then let's grab this. And then, yeah, we need to get out. Uh, Megalosaurus, cool, I do actually want to read about that. Right. Then this is just the end, isn't it? Okay, we need to get out now. We're really low on health, 100 HP. Da, 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 okay, I don't know if we can make these jumps. We're gonna have to be really careful. If we fall off, we're fucked. Oh no! Oh no! She failed to make the jump. Fuck, uh, at least she didn't die, but I'm gonna die because of hypothermia. Wonderful. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, how do I do this then? How do I do it? Let's see. Sprint and. No, she's done it again! No! Yeah, I'd shit myself as well falling off that. Can she just not make the jumps? Um, Alright, one second, let's see if we can change something. Uh, harvest settings, uh, enable victim, harvest setting, resource gathering. Let's see, can we get, get these bats to come and get us? Do not have a lot of health. I'm thinking maybe if we can gather some hide, we might be able to survive. There's some hide. Right, there's some mushrooms here. Please give me... Um, Fiber mushroom, please. Oh no, I can't. There's nothing to harvest here. Fuck. I thought I could harvest the mushrooms, but I can't. Oh. That's it then, isn't it? Wait, no, no, no I've got fiber. No! <laughs> I had fiber in my inventory. Oh, I have a bed here. This could be really stupid. <laughs> Should we just run? I mean, for a start, I'm going to have to chuck myself off a cliff, off the top of this. It's not quite a cliff, but you get what I mean. Um, all right. I mean, there's only one way for it. But la 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 la! Cool, the water cushioned our fall. Which means we can survive long enough to get eaten by that. Let's run. Okay, 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 okay. If we're quick, if we're quick. And we'll grab a bit of fiber while we're here. And then we can make our hide gear. Right. Um, oh god, there's a T-Rex. Oh fuck. No, no, no. Scale, where are you? Beautiful girl. Um, we just lie down and hide in a bush. And wait for our stamina to come back and then we can sprint. It's not working, it's not working. That whole stay still thing is a myth. Oh, you are fucking me. Uh, there weren't any T-Rexes when I was here a minute ago. Now, there is nothing but T-Rexes. Although, to be fair, thinking about it, T-Rexes are probably the best thing it could be. Like, 
If it was um, anything faster, they'd catch and kill me. But T-Rexes are so slow, I've been able to get away from them. That's actually fair. Right, let's get our stamina back, and then let's see. We need to be careful, we need to be quick. Uh, why is it so foggy in the cave? Oh, there we go. Fog's gone. And we're freezing. Wonderful. Right, it was in... And then turn right, wasn't it? And then right again. Yeah, it's here. If everything's respawned, we're dead. If even some of the stuff's respawned, we're still kind of dead. It's way too high for us to throw ourselves off. But if we can get down there and get ourselves into some armor that negates this cold, because it's not that cold. Minus five. Jesus Christ, I'm in England. Minus five is fucking t-shirt and shorts weather, you pathetic man. Look at him. All that muscle and hair and fucking he dies from minus five. Pathetic. <sighs> like, I've genuinely played rugby games in minus eight, I think. I think that's as cold as we went. I don't think we went any lower than that. I played Winter League Rugby, so... Yeah, minus five. <laughs> minus five's a nice day, you fucking softy. Oh, God. Right. We're almost down there. It does look like most of the stuff we killed is still in a state of killed, which is good. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'm starving. That's fine. I've got all this stuff here. Hi, scale. Alright, let's grab all this. And yeah, yeah, I'm hungry. Uh, Alright, let's eat. Oh, God, our health is really dropping, isn't it? Alright, let's grab this, this, and then let's make... What are we trying to make? It's hide shirt, hide pants, hide hat, hide gloves. Hide boots, inventory. Really, even with all that, you're still cold. We're losing it a lot, a lot lower, a lot slower. But Jesus Christ, that's pathetic. Is hide better than cloth? Uh, hypothermic insulation, hide. Keeps you warm. Yeah, so hide is the best. And we're still cold. Right. Oh, we've lost our torch. That's fine. Got another one. Actually, can we hold a torch and put a torch on the dino? Will that help? Multiple torches. Look, I'm wearing full kit and I'm sat next to two fires and it's minus five degrees and I'm still freezing to death. Who decided minus five was freezing to death and what is wrong with you? Go see a doctor for fuck's sake. Sorry, I'm taking the whole minus five thing a bit personal. <laughs> Right, uh, okay, we're almost there, we're almost there, we're almost there, we go. No, 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 fuck you, no, that's a long way to fall. And we've fallen up. Oh look, there's a thing there. No! Well, Scale wasn't with us for very long, was she? Right, let's see if we do any better on foot until, you know, the fucking T-Rexes. Oh, no. Well, fuck. See, I told you, I told you I was getting too confident. I'm not gonna get out. I'm gonna die in here. Because of minus fucking five. Can we even make this jump? Yes. We're better at it than the dinosaur, apparently. Run 
Oh, shit. I don't have time to be tired. You're dying. Okay, can we make that? Probably not. Let's wait for a tiny bit of stamina. We, just, we do not have the ability to do this at all. At least we'll die with our stuff closer to the entrance. There we go, we made it. We're not going to manage to get through the swim. Through the swim, that the swim's going to kill us. And there we go. So we've lost our dinosaur. We've died twice, and we can't respawn. Oh no, we can respawn there, but respawning there would just be stupid at this point, wouldn't it? Um... Yep, we'll respawn at the bed and we'll take a bird. I think. Maybe. A bird. Oh, look, you can actually. I could have respawned up there before I had the bed. That's cool. Ah. Uh, bed and bird or naked mad dash for it again? I, I think naked mad dash for it again. Let's do it. <laughs> it's more fun. Okay, right. We're going to go a different route this time. We're going to obviously jump into the water. <laughs> and this time we're going to go straight over the top rather than round. Try and expose ourselves to the least number of monsters. Um, obviously that means we're going to run straight into a bunch of saber cats who are quickly going to kill us. Let's maybe not sprint to the point where we have no stamina. Let's just be careful and if we could grab this, that'd be cool. Wonder what you've got. What have you got for me? A bullet. One bullet. I mean, that's that's ominous, isn't it? That's some Jack Sparrow shit, that. Marooned on an island with one bullet. Oh no, cat. I see cat. Fuck. Oh look! It's where I died. Just, you know. Right, okay. We'll use the T-Rex as cover. Because it's slow. It's stupid. We are quick and also stupid. Da -da -da -da. There we are. There's the cave. Right. Our stuff should be quite close to the entrance this time. It can't follow us in. I tried to come in in here in a cave in a on a T-Rex once and it failed miserably. So it should not be able to follow us. I can't believe Scale died. Um, it's trying. I'm really, I am genuinely really sad about Scale, she was awesome, but it's kind of depressing because I've reached the stage where she's not special, like, I can just go and get another one. Her parents will lay another Scale, which is kind of sad, really. Miss that, um... the uniqueness, the specialness that each of the individual dinos had. Right at the beginning. Okay, we're almost there. We need to hurry up, otherwise we'll freeze to death. We're taking massive damage just from coming down. Oh no! Oh, fuck off! Oh, we survived it. Where's our stuff? Our stuff's up there! Not down here. Of course it fucking is. So we have to climb back up. I'm just gonna die again because of the cold out. This might end. I might end up giving up. Um, but there's too much good stuff. My best crossbow, my gun, and stuff. Wait, it's just here. Oh, it's all here. Okay. Where's my gear? Oh. I have to like take it. I have to strip my own body. Cool. And we're really low on health again. Oh, we made the jump. Good. 
Right, that's a good start. That's a good start. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. There we go. We made the last... No, this isn't the last jump, but it's one of the last jumps. Oh, okay, okay, okay. It's all good. It's all good. The more we do, the closer we get. Let's eat some food. Got another jump here. No! This is the one that killed us last time. Oh! You are fucking kidding me! Okay. This is tremendously frustrating. Do we have the blueprints for anything that will keep me warm? We have the blueprints for green pants. We have... Uh, we have purple. Yeah, that's good. Is it? Yeah, keeps you warm, yeah. Okay. Uh, as you can tell, I'm taking this very well. I'm, I'm definitely not... <laughs> really heartbroken about everything going to shit. I definitely, definitely am not. <laughs> so pissed off. Right, we've got green, green, purple, purple, blue. Wait, hypothermic insulation minus. Hyper and hypothermic. Shit. Oh, which one's cold? Wait, no. This specifically says it keeps you warm. So, I'm going to guess hypothermic is for cold and hyperthermic is for hot. Shut up. <laughs> My uh, my scientist wife is in the background pissing herself, laughing at me. Uh, right, this one keeps you cool, and hyperthermic is really high. Right, okay, so hyperthermic is hot, hypothermic is cold. Right, good. So, I am not an idiot. It's fine. <laughs> okay, so this is good. We now have hypothermic insulation 200 and 300. Right. Right, you cold bastard. I'm coming for you. It's actually, right, look, it's actually a good thing that I've died. You see, this is all part of my cunning plan because, because after my dino died, uh, we need some food, don't we? we? Probably should grab some food. After um, Scale died, I had no way of getting back. So that that is why I cunningly and with great forethought chose to perish in order uh, fuck it, I'm going to taste my eggs <laughs> chose to perish in order to facilitate my fast travel back to my home thereby allowing me to pick up a bird it's, it's all part of the grand plan, the master plan and totally isn't part of my glaring failure and you just caught a tiny glimpse of part of the mega base I'm building. Well, I don't know if it classifies as a mega base in Ark, but you will see it properly later. Yeah, I'm trying to drop the whole soul teasing thing. I'm, I'm trying to be mysterious and engaging. It doesn't work, does it? <laughs> right, we're going to fly back to this island and... And keep fucking trying. Oh, we need to get the stuff. We need to get our stuff. So, I'll see you at the island. Okay, we're back on the island. For better or for worse, we are back on the fucking island. We are wearing... That's not me, that's a dinosaur. We're wearing some pretty decent leather gear. And there's the green beam of death. I'm a bit worried about where we can park our 
bird. I'm thinking maybe like around here. And then we sort of jump down, basically parking it right above the entrance to the cave. I think that's going to be the best option. It's the least likely to get itself killed up here. Um, just make sure it's on neutral. Yep, so it can actually defend itself if something tries to eat it. Otherwise, it'll just sit there, and that's bad. And uh, we're already taking damage. Okay, fuck. Right, let's see. So. It's hot. It says it's hot. Still quite warm. We're hot. We're cold. We're in minus five. We're in the cold, and we're not dying. Which means we're immune to the hypothermia now. No, nope, we're not immune to the hypothermia. We moved from minus five to minus five, and then we started taking damage because... Of course we fucking did. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I find the hypothermia of this cave a bit stupid. I mean, if you want me to die because of cold, put it at like minus 10 or minus 15 or something, like... Not minus fucking five. Right. I think trying to drop down there would be really stupid. Uh, maybe from here we could. If we do it carefully, or we just throw ourselves down, that works as well. Right, let's grab everything. And let's grab all this. And then let's hold our torch. And we're still somehow freezing. No! There we go! There we go. We finally defeated the hypothermia. I love the, uh... <laughs> this is where we died both times. <laughs> oh, we're going to end up with a collection, aren't we? Fuck. Uh, we really need a haircut. Oh, dearie me. Okay. Right. Oh. No, let's eat something. Let's see. Can we buff our health at all? Oh, you. Oh, that worked. The egg, the egg works. The egg's good. Let's eat another egg. Some meat. There we go. There we go. Health going up now. Right. Let's get rid of this. Get rid of this. Get rid of this. Okay, there we go. And we're apparently taking hypothermia. Nope, we're not. It really doesn't seem to make up, be able to make up its mind about whether or not we're taking hypothermic damage. Right. I'm not going to go that way. I'm going to go the, the way that I think is the long way around. This way. Okay, let's be careful. Well, suck us. Do we still have the artifacts or do we lose them when we die? No, we've got the artifact to the clever... And um, artifact to the devourer. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So it doesn't matter how many times we die. <laughs> Just keep banging our very unkempt heads against the problem until it goes away. Right. Okay. This is the bit. This is the bit. Okay. Let's see. And jump. Yes. Oh god. There's another one. <laughs> that was a appropriately timed shit. And there we go. Right, is that it? I think it is. I don't know why there's this here. Are we supposed to just be able to just jump straight off? I'd rather not. There's bats and stuff still down here, so let's get the hell out. Oh, this is where we emerge from the cave now, thinking that we're safe and a T-Rex bites our head off. As soon as we get to the bird, though. That's it. As soon as we're on our bird, we're good. So we're going to get to the cave entrance. And we're hot. Okay, we can put the fire away. Come on then, birdie. Yeah, come on. Come on. Oh my god. Success! There we go. There it is. We have officially raided three caves today with what can only be described as varying degrees of success. 
but we have three artifacts, which is three more than we had at the beginning. We have, you know, a moment of silence for scale. She, uh, she was not designed for the jumping in that cave, really, was she, bless her. But there it is. There we go. We managed it, and we're free. It, it, we can get home completely safely now, no problem whatsoever, so that's it. Oh, thank you very much for watching. I hope that by the next episode, I'll have the base ready to show you. Maybe, maybe not. If not, then there's still an absolute ton of stuff to do in this game that I haven't done yet, so there will definitely be something. But hopefully it's the base. I'm really looking forward to showing it you. I'm really looking forward to getting some water tames because uh, I know that there are caves in the water as well. I know that there are ocean caves and stuff, and there's stuff at the bottom of the sea. I'm really looking forward to playing with electricity. All the stuff I haven't actually been able to do yet, and really do need to do. So, thank you very much for watching, and we'll say it. I'll say it to you, and you can say it to Scale. Goodbye.